and if you're looking forward to a parade coming up in Denver. When is parade? When is parade? Thursday. No. <laughs> I need to go home. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Gotcha. And on the other end, how would you rate your defense tonight? You tell me, man. I'm gonna know something about you. What, how would you rate my defense tonight? Be honest. There's no wrong answers. Be honest. Be honest. I can accept that. You know, Kevin, uh, that was talk about you coming back for the playoffs last year. So you really just been working on your game, trying to get back your timing and conditioning, really, be, to be honest, correct? Yeah. Uh, the overall, you talk about growth, the growth with Brandon Clark and Jaron's defensive games. Uh, y'all's, as a trio, a big deal. Where, where are you from, bro? Oh, I'm, I, I'm from Tennessee. Oh, that's a sick accent, bro. I haven't heard that before. That's awesome, dude. That's I, sick. I, I, I that's appreciate amazing. the kind – I'm a fan of yours as well. I appreciate the kind words. Thank you, sir. So if you get a win tonight, that would breed confidence going into those next four games against teams in the similar spots beside you in the table. Where are you from, Jim? Ireland. I like your accent. It's tough. Oh. I want to learn how to talk like that. But ask your question again. I was too much listening to your accent. Amen. At the end of the Minnesota game, you said, let the ball come to me because I know I'm going to make it. Was that the same feeling tonight, Cole? Yeah. 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 Come on. <laughs> yeah. Last question of the night. Who is a better color commentator, Del Curry or Michael Thompson? And it's one guy's birthday today, so. Oh, it's, it's your pop's birthday? I'm not saying names. Respect. Happy birthday to, to pop, pop, Papa Thompson. Uh, I got to go Del Curry, though. We, oh, my. Oh, man. What's wrong with <laughs> He's out. He's walking off. Yeah, thank you, follow uh, Cuban just walked by and was chanting MVP towards you, Boban. How did that make you feel? Oh, I feel amazing. You know, first time on TV. Hi, man. Hi, Dad. Hi, family. I'm here in Dallas. <laughs> it has been a delight to have you on Boban. our show inside the NBA. Boban, before thank we let you, you go, I got to hear it. You rang. <laughs> you rang. Yeah. <laughs> I, I love, love you, Boban. <laughs> <laughs> I love you, Boban. Thank you, brother. Yeah. <laughs> oh, thank, thank you, you so and, much. And, and thank you guys because choose me and not Luca. First time. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> this is what movies is made of. This is what movies this is, is what movies is made of. Four months away, I come back. Two free throws. Don't worry about it. I got that. Uh, played basketball for a long time, so um, if I. <laughs> okay, I won't say that. I won't say the word after I'm that. I'm up. I'm yeah, up. mother. Stop, yeah, mother. <laughs> like, get mother off level. Get off me. Austin, there was a play where you, you were kind of running down the sideline, chasing down a loose ball, and got thrown into the front row. Um, a bunch of drinks got spilled, I think. Uh, it seemed like the bench kind of enjoyed that. Uh, I'm curious kind of what they said to you when you walk back over there. Oh, I asked Brown if that was his Lobos over there, because it smelled horrible. <laughs> uh, but, uh, I'm an investor, bro, what you say? <laughs> that don't mean it don't taste good. Uh, so, again, two decades in the game. Is there, I've been asking all the teammates that come over here about their favorite LeBron play <laughs> in those 20 years. I want you to tell me yours, but before you tell me yours, yeah. I asked Pat Bev, what's his favorite <laughs> LeBron highlight over the last 20? This fool, he going to say, the block I had on LeBron. <laughs> <laughs> yo, yo, man. What's wrong with Pat, man? What's wrong with Pat, man? He mentioned his highlight, man. <laughs> <laughs> What's wrong with Pat, man? Pat got a problem, man. He got issues. Last time a Rocket had back-to-back 43-point games was back in 1982, Moses Malone. I wasn't even born there. Rest in peace. I wasn't even born there, no. Um, you know, Hall of Famer. But you got your rhythm going now. Thanks, James. <laughs> Thank you, follow well. Luca, it's never been done in NBA history. A 60-point, 20-rebound, triple-double. 60 points, 20 boards. Never, it never happened, baby. How's it feel right now? I'm tired as hell. <laughs> you can rest later. You're young. I need a recovery beer. What differentiates you when the defense is right there in your face and you still hit those tough shots? Uh, you know, my teammates have confidence in me. I work on those shots every day. And, you know, it just went down tonight. I was able to knock it down.
All right, thank you, Kawhi. We've got to go. Thank you. One, all right. That was great. <laughs> Wait, you want more questions? No, I'm good. I'm good with one. <laughs> all right, guys. Kawhi Jonathan Cho, Dia TV. If the Raptors win the NBA title, what do you think this will mean for Canada and the Toronto Raptors? You've already won with the San Antonio Spurs. You've seen the way it impacted that community. What do you think this will do for Canada? Um, I'm really not sure. Um, I guess you really have to ask somebody on the street or one of our fans. Uh. Oscar, yeah, they win Oscar. So this is an Oscar-worthy script for Last Dance for my last season. Um, I couldn't have asked for anything more. Obviously, people say, yeah, I asked to get in the playoffs and all that. Welcome back, LeBron. <laughs> Kiss. He's soft. He's not. He's not even in my league. Like nowhere near me. Um, and if if I was their coach, I would I would never put him on me ever again. He he's like no. Put somebody else on me because I'm I'm a tad up every time we play. He's trash. Tonight you used impressive dribbling skills to successfully uh, fake out your opponents multiple times. And um, in the second quarter, you made a jump shot where your body was turned like 180 degrees away from the basket. It was just an amazing shot. You're always making these spectacular moves with just within a split second. Um, do you anticipate doing them or is it just a second nature to you? Like, do you just not even have to think about it? Um, you know, the way you explain it, you need to be around more often. I, 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 you know, I just try to go out and do the best way, the, the best way I can. You get another triple double, perfect from the field, perfect from the free throw line. The first player ever to do that. Thoughts on that? Ah, that's pretty interesting. Uh, Russell, things got a little contentious between you and, and uh, Patrick Beverly. Can you talk about you know kind of what happened there? Oh yeah, he was talking about he was first team all defense, but I I I, I didn't know what the hell he was talking about because. I had 42 at the time. Um, the series, you know, I don't know what he talking about. Maybe he was dreaming of some shit. I don't know. Sorry, excuse my cuss word, but I don't know what he was talking about. But I guess he, he wanted to be first team all defense or something. Maybe he was dreaming about it. But now it shocked me because he said he looked up and said, no, what can garbage? You have, I got 40 points. I'm like, that's nice. He took 34 shots to get it. <laughs> I mean, no, I'm not trying to, I'm not trying to bash anybody, but I mean, you know, men lie, women lie, but the numbers don't. I mean, I mean, he's Kevin Durant. I promise we tried. <laughs> it's, we didn't roll over. <laughs> and we didn't just say, hey, man, you know what, just come on, give us 50 tonight. Of course not. You know, he's a hell of a player. <laughs> the shots he took, you know, he made some tough shots. If you was a coach, what would you tell us to do? Thank you. <laughs> to take, to... We tried everything. <laughs> all right, all right. All right. So we, we we tried everything. We had we had several different coverages for KD, and they didn't work. <laughs> Wardell, um, why is Kelly so good at putback dunks? Uh, freak athlete, but he's got a great eye for the timing of it, and. Um, you no, know, you can jump that high and you're looking for those opportunities, then, you know, good things happen. So he makes it look really good, though. I will say that he makes it look really good. Uh, what happened on that Gobert kerfuffle at, at the end? That is a word right there. <laughs> <laughs> what did you say? Kerfuffle. Good job, bro. That's strong. Um, toward the end of the game, uh, you shot a three, kind of putting the dagger into him, and you looked toward the crowd, toward uh, Rihanna. Uh, was was that uh, um, uh, on purpose, or or do you remember that? Or I don't even remember that. <laughs> well, just to let you know, social media is buzzing about. Really? It. Yes. Don't get in that trap. Yeah, bro. don't get in that. <laughs> I'm cool. Have fun with that. Uh, Joker Shaq here, first of all, see Anya Igra Brate, uh, and what is it going to take you to go into uh, Portland and win game three? No, there's nothing wrong with your headset, that's no, just it. See Anya Igra Brate. <laughs> ah, yeah, thank you, man. Well, I yes, well, yes. Uh -huh. uh, <laughs> now you are an NBA champion, Nicola, how does that feel? It's good, it's good. 
the job is done, we can go home now. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs>